Hello everybody Welcome to my next episode of Half is Strange Sorry, final Yes, final episode of Half is Strange My name is Takukiam and uh, I hope you Okay, choose wisely past, present, and future. Come on, wake up! Wake up! Wake up now! You must wake up! Yes, kind of like Chloe? Why? She's not there. Where? In the dark room. In the dark room? Yes, I say. I can't see. Come on. Okay. No. no. Somebody help me. <laughs> These straps no. are hurt. Finally, I'm free. Almost. Oh, only one life. Okay. Surely four. Come on. A syringe? What kind? What can I see on a syringe? I hate looking at myself like that. You'll pay for this, Jefferson. I promised I would never go back in time like this again. But this is the only way. This angle highlights your purity, see? The slightly unconscious model is often the most open and honest. Vanity. Posing, just pure expression. Oh, Christ. Look at that perfect face. Where is the hole? Hold that stare there! Stay still! Come on, man. I'm on drugs. Oh, Max! You fucked up my shot! But please don't worry. We have all the time in the world. For now, I knew you were special the second I saw your first selfie. Yes, I still hate that word. But I love the purity of your own image. Not like Rachel, who was always looking in the wrong places. Poor Rachel. Wait. Let me try this angle. Don't move! Oh. <sighs> Much better. Thanks, Max. If only Nathan could see this setup. He tried so hard. But you can't just throw a few subjects around and 
expect a cohesive style or theme, but he had an eye for shadows and an eye for a whole lot more, as his elite family will find out, along with Arcadia Bay. Nice. Good. Oh, those eyes. It's just too bad you're so goddamn nosy, Max. But this room is under 24-7 surveillance, so all I had to do was text you from Nathan's phone. And you fell right into my hands. You really should have focused on schoolwork, not private detecting with your little friend. Chloe. Chloe, right. Yeah, I'm sorry that I killed... that Nathan killed her in self-defense. But she had a troubled history like most Arcadia Bay dropouts. Nobody will be surprised. Or care. Though I promise, people will care when you die tonight, Max. I wasn't lying when I said you have a gift. Okay. Now this looks good. Maybe a few more close-ups. Max, please do not move so much. I need you posed and framed my way. Fuck you. Maybe a new dose will calm you oh, down. No. No. Now don't move or this will hurt much. Stupid! Bitch! You just don't listen, do you? In fact, you never did hear much in my class. If you had, you might have seen all this coming. God damn, you are a fighter. I've had my eye on you, and I've noticed that you've been more fearless this week than maybe your whole life. Remember my number one rule. Always take a shot. Okay, so I change nothing. Oh, Jesus. I can't believe that happened. So sick. Broken via. Oh. Oh. What about this picture? Oh. I'm definitely more awake in this photo. I could try this one. This might work. Please work. Why? Why? I'm getting some spectacular images here, Max. Yes, Victoria would kill to be in your place, but she doesn't understand our connection. You're the winner, Max. I choose you, your portrait. Fuck you. You're trying too hard. Um, glad. I know you're scared. You all have the same doe-eyed look when you wake up here. Replaced by fear as you realize what's about to happen. Mr. Jefferson, why are you doing this? Oh, <laughs> Max. I'm so glad you asked that question. Uh, simply put, I'm obsessed with the idea of capturing that moment. Innocence evolves into corruption. That shift from black to white to gray and beyond. Most models are cynical. They lose that naivete. However, some Blackwell students carry their hope and optimism with them like an aura 
and those lucky few become my models, my subjects. Yes, you're a psychopath, and this is your last session. Au contraire, Max. I'm so sane that nobody knows what's happening to you right now. And don't get me started on your late partner. I had enough of those faux punk sluts in my Seattle days. Hey, you killed Chloe. Come on, you know it. Go to hell. That's... Name. Go to hell. You will for everybody you've hurt. Unlike pure sweet Kate Marsh. I don't believe in that bullshit. She could have been my masterpiece. The world is what an artist makes it. And my muse. Okay, okay. Artist don't kill. <laughs> Artist kill. Maybe not people, but kill. Blah, blah, blah. God, I hate your voice now. You might as well savor it, considering it's the last you'll hear. Oh. <laughs> that struck a nerve. Your face changed color. Beautiful. You will not get away with this. I want you to know that. Then why did you blame David Madsen for stalking Kate? Of course he was the only person who was about to find out the truth. Irony. I do know that the Prescotts are going to have a major scandal when the town finds out what their elite son has been doing for homework. Yes, Max must know it. He's as sick as you. Don't He's in judge people. Prescott. But that's why Nathan never should have been at Blackwell. Didn't you didn't care about him. You're wrong again. He was genuinely talented, and his father is a serious asshole, as you might know. I know. I became mm. a sort of father figure for Nathan. It happens often in teacher-student relationships. It was kind of touching for a while. Did you tell him everything about your plans at Blackwell? Don't be stupid, Max. I told him what he needed to hear. In return, I had access to the Prescott fortune. Who do you think paid for this glorious dark room and equipment? How else could I get all these hip new drugs for my subjects? Rachel Amber was your victim, not your subject. Oh. Rachel Amber. Hm. That's the real tragedy. Nathan thought he could be an artist like me. Instead, the dumbass gave her an overdose. Why Rachel? Why Rachel? I don't have time to tell you everything. But she was special. A human chameleon, so many visual possibilities. We had a real connection. She Did she let you take pictures of her? Rachel was in love with me. That's not my ego, just Look at our sessions. Not that I'll let you. Nobody loved having their picture taken more. Anyway, Rachel is dead. But no tears. Los Angeles would have killed her anyway, so look at this as a favor. You're evil. Oh, I see. You and your friends almost beat Nathan to death. See, we're not so different. Yes, yes we are. I cared more about Nathan than you did. No, you didn't. It's just too bad that he fell in lust with Rachel. He actually thought he could mimic what I do with the camera and subject, like father, but not like son. Where is Nathan now? Dead and buried. After what he did to Rachel, I knew I couldn't keep him as a protege for much longer. Now the police will never find his body. Do you finally get it now, Max? So he is I can't also my dead. Vision with amateurs. You are an amateur. Look at the trail of death you left behind. You can't blame all this on Nathan. I don't care what you do to me. You're gonna die, motherfucker. For Chloe, and Rachel, and everybody else. I do love your spirit, Max. 
Alex, but you brought yourself here. By your own choice. Anyway, I like my models to be seen and not heard. So I have to make sure there's nothing left behind of you. Okay. Now, let's see how these shots came out. I can see why your instant camera is so appealing. You don't need a computer to print your work out. Okay. What can I do here? No. Sorry. This is... This I have one. all those photos in my diary. This, this could be a way out. Maybe. Max, I wish you could see yourself now. Okay. Hey. Uh, Wait. Please, Mr. Jefferson. Max, I would love to talk shop, but I really need to go over these pictures, especially while they're fresh in my mind. I think our session was a career high for me. Oh, mind you. You... Let me you go. You still have my diary. Don't Are you worry. serious? Nobody's going to read it. Thanks for reminding me. There's nothing more innocent than a teenager's diary. Oh. Look at your selfies. What a waste of talent. Look at that shot, Max. You can do so much better. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic trick. Right back where I started Max. this insane week. And nobody course, is going to hurt Chloe ever again. The portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? It was the green process. This but I yes um, who cares <laughs> who cares this class is hella bullshit I'll pretend you didn't say that and let you try to answer one more sorry there's no time left I mean your class is almost over oh well Thanks for the warning, Max. So, the Daguerrean process made portraiture quite popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you finish reading the assigned chapters. Clearly, Max doesn't have the uh, time. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday time Heroes. Time to change time. The winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the First. Art Let's make it real easy to capture Mark Jefferson. Melissa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Bastard. I have to warn David about Jefferson and the dark room. So. Hey, okay. No, no. Yes, I can warn David right now. Oh, except I need his damn number. Mm. The 
This diary literally saved my life. I should be able to track down David's number from the school pamphlet. Found you. Oh. Yes, David the Manson. And now you use cell phone. For once, David, I'm praying you'll overreact to this as much as everything else. And take Jefferson down fast. You wanted me to enter the contest, asshole. So maybe I'll be going to San Francisco. And Jefferson, you'll be going to prison. Uh, the past was in the past. Am I pushing myself too hard? Uh, I it think, doesn't matter what yeah. happens to me. I have to save Chloe. I can't go right now. Mr. Jefferson, we need to talk. Uh. Can you see I'm talking to Mr. Jefferson now? I can see you're kissing ass again. Nothing new. What did you just say? Hold on, Victoria. Are you okay, Max? Not until Victoria knows that hiding behind a screen and posting videos of people is totally fucked up. You know how easy it is to hurt somebody? To destroy their life? Are you proud of yourself? If you have any feelings left, you should think about your actions. Listen, I, I didn't... Of course you did. You're so insecure, you can't even be happy with your own town. You have to try and bring everybody down to your mean and ugly left. Okay, I do not have to listen to this bullshit. Do I, Mr. Jefferson? Well, it looks like you already did, Victoria. Then, I guess I'm done talking. I sure hope so. Bye. I'm not going to say I didn't enjoy that, but... Why? Here's my photograph for the Everyday Heroes contest. Oh, uh, that was easy. No. It wasn't easy at all. Well, I, uh... I, I can't prejudge yet, but I'm very... Happy you decided to enter. That means a lot to me. And Blackwell, the, the first step for any artist is to put themselves out there in the world without fear. To be innocent. Or guilty. Uh, well, thanks for the photo. And maybe both of us will be jet setting to San Francisco this Friday. Or maybe only one of us will be going. Don't be so modest, Max. Anything can happen in a week. As you're going to find out, Mr. Jefferson. Yes. Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Okay. Oh, nothing changed yet. This changed. Okay, Jefferson and Nathan. And this won't happen. San Francisco, baby. This will not happen. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. 
Okay. Bus, bus, and You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. I hope I did everything right this time. Um, did you? Good work, David. Yes, very good. in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited too. Yeah. What can I do here? Okay. Wait from the beginning of the end for Jefferson and Prescott's. Uh, bye bye. Has it Frisco, so please don't. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe and I used to totally play the video game and watch him all the time <laughs> when we were innocent. Was the joke, man? Did it exist? I have to admit, I love being called an artist. so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. Please fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us. Anytime. Uh, I don't think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. Uh. How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. It's been a tough week at Blackwell. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, Things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop one. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco, but we all want you to have a great experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. Another nosebleed? Why? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. What? 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 San Francisco is so cool, and this gallery is huge. 
So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Work the room. I don't know. I, I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Max, after this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Hell, I wanted to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm gonna eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. Bowser, Max. You did it. Somehow. I went from the dark room to this gallery. I've been through so many realities in one week. Life is... weird. Yeah. So... Look at this print. The depth of field, the colors. Look at the bulk of shape. This was definitely shot with a I medium format that camera using a Leica 35mm You enjoyed lens. this? Video, so I think this is enough for uh, this moment. Also, be cool, Max. I think Smile you don't say anything stupid. If you enjoy it, leave a like here. Uh, comment this video and share this video between your friends and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel in video description of this video is also a link on my facebook page where, where you can find what i publish and when so Goodbye.